Ah, welcome return. <laughs> it's about time we had that again. It's season three. No more jockeys. The oldest game in the world. No more jockeys, yeah. The game is fun. The game is meant to be entertaining. Fun. And it's lovely. <laughs> yes! We're three of the uh, main amb ambassadors for No More Jockeys. Three old friends. Three old friends. We got to know each other in that first set. Actually, we'd met before. We had. We didn't, we didn't meet by playing No More Jockeys, but it definitely concreted the relationship. Who am I? Porn is a serious figure. Try to get the youth on board. Yeah, it'd be nice to sort of get mop up some of that audience, wouldn't it? What's my jungle name? Well, it's me, Alex Horn. Hmm. That's how Alex always introduces himself, by the way, for the viewers at home. What's the health minister? I can't remember anyone's names. Matt Hancock. Yeah, you look like Matt Hancock. Get you do look like Matt Hancock. It's not come up for a bit, but you do. I think you do well at the game, Horn, uh, for someone that can never remember anyone's names. I don't know who he is. <laughs> oh, what's, it, what's it called when it's... I don't know anything. But what's my relationship with the game? Alex, are you here to meet, make friends or to uh, win games? I've got friends. Oh, hi, mate. Hello, Tim. Hello, Tim. Bit of Tim. Bit of Timmy. <laughs> who am I? A short, sharp shock appearance and maybe quite enjoyable for the audience. Tim Key. Well, I, I, I mean, I'm just, I'm looking like I'm thinking, but there's nothing really going on. I don't know, it's, uh, you know, half the stuff that's going on in this game. We all win about the same amount. Well, apart, apart from, um, yes. <laughs> wow, hey. I was talking to someone the other day about my performance in this uh, game show, oh. and they said that I didn't get on so well because I'm a bit too much of a laugh. Oh, a bit lower because of your eyes. I just think your pal, he's got a point. It's lovely you do these nice, funny things. But I don't think it's the only reason why you're doing so badly. Let's get Watto involved. The guy down here. My name is John. Uh, my <laughs> name is Mark Watson. Yeah, thank you, Mark. Oh, welcome, Mark. Hoi, hoi, hoi. Mark Watson! <laughs> I am a nice guy. I see, senor. No, I agree with you so much. It's always quite dark, his, 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 his realm. It's like the start of a Bond movie. So, off we go. Key to play. Key to play. Key to play. I'm ready. <laughs> Hang on, I'm not ready, actually. Sorry, I should have got ready whilst you were getting ready. Hang on. Good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. Hope everyone wins. Ding, ding. Round one. Moses. Kevin Nah. Jesus Christ. Enya. I'm going for the little man on the Pringles box. No more people any of us have been in a car with. No more people that you can find a picture of them with onions. No more diddly names. No more people holding a plate on grass. Guys, I would like to present someone to you. Yay! Yay! I would like to present to the companies. May I present to Yao? She's been on the radar for good few months now, but I would like to present to you my dearest friend, Penelope Pitstop. Ah. Penelope Pitstop. Penelope Pitstop. Penelope Pitstop. Ah. <laughs> no more people who, for their job, have to touch something. Why are you using for her job as the start of this? <laughs> After all that we've been through. <laughs> Penelope Pitstop. Ah. Oh. Have we had her before? We have. I, it rings a bell. No more people that we've had before. <gasps> Fuck. Actual off. This is a famous game. This is a famous game. Oh. Banksy. Ah. Challenge. I think Banksy's come up before. I think he's been named before. Oh. Guys behind the... Guys under the line. Like, what? An extreme guy? Can you... <laughs> Can you write down all the all the people ever? He's out. This is someone called Jennifer Schlicht. I tell you what, yeah. someone below the line won me the game last week by having chronicled every move that had ever been made. So I've got nothing against the guys behind, below the line. Either. 
sometimes we look we look below the line and we go, there's yeah. a lot going on. And other times you just go, bop, bop. And then it, then it burst into song. Sometimes he's a silhouette. And, and sometimes, sometimes we see colours. <laughs> Whoa, kitchen conversions. That's what they all sing. Da 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 da. Oh, pum 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 pum. Oh, ti ti ti. I was waiting for the chorus. Wait, downtown now. Nah. It's good. This is music to my, to be fair, ears. Okay, David Dickinson. He's not a storyteller, is he? Unless you can't. This is a story. This is a vase. <laughs> <laughs> so one thing I'm interested in is storytelling. I think I'd be okay if he's an after-dinner speaker, wouldn't I? That's like telling stories and anecdotes. Let's get my old mucker Watto on the case. I mean, bear in mind, I'm not walking if it says he's an after-dinner speaker, unless we find examples of him telling stories. Dickinson is an after-dinner speaker. David Dickinson's got um, an audio book, and that's, by the look of it, a book of um, stories from David Dickinson's life. I guess I'm out. Yeah, I, I think, I, it, I do think he's told some stories here. Yeah. I he's think if he's got... written a book, you've got to go. I think it was a good category. And then a good challenge. This guy isn't a storyteller. Do you know what it says he is? He's an auctioneer. He's not a storyteller. Look, we've all walked <laughs> on stuff. We've all walked, but it doesn't mean that's what they do. <laughs> Whose goes it? Yours, actually. Yeah, no, it goes uh, Key Watson Horn and then back to Key Watson Horn again. Unless you play a reverse card, then it'll be me again. Ah, I didn't know we had a reverse card. Yeah, yeah. All right. Not been played yet. I'll play it now. Oh. Reverse card. Don't look at your bookshelves. Don't yeah. look at your books. Are you struggling? Yes, Are yes. you struggling? Cats, there's some tough cats. There's some tough cats. There's some tough cats. Fiddly. Fiddly, isn't there? This is fiddly. This is fiddly. Now, that is a fiddly one, actually. A fiddly one. Not particularly. Not for me. Not for someone like me. Well, you are literally fiddling. Nancy Kerrigan, normal people who, with the best will in the world, when they go to work, could slice a cucumber in half with stuff they're wearing. <laughs> go on, there another. Ted says a hand. <laughs> no, fair enough, yeah. So it's something they're wearing. So you're saying he's wearing the scissors? Yeah, that's important. It can't just be a piece of equipment. It's got to be something that they have on, is it? Yes, part of their equipment and something they have on. Alex Horn. Hmm. Challenge. Right. Uh, I've, have you seen Taskmaster? I, I've seen Taskmaster. It's good. It's good. It's a good show. You say my clipboard. You think I wear a clipboard? Well, to be fair, I've got a cucumber and I've got an iPad. I'll go and have a look. What's that? <laughs> uh, this is my this is my iPad. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. Problems already. <laughs> right. Okay. We're good. <laughs> No, you're okay. Hansel. From Hansel and Gretel. Challenge. Uh huh. Uh huh. European. <laughs> I think I'm digging in. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Why are you digging in? He's European. Yeah, but he's not real, so he doesn't come from anywhere. He's probably from a time before, like when it was all one continent. Why right? are you arguing, Paul? But oh, he's right. He, uh, he's right. He's, he's also comes from a time before Europe was uh, defined in that way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The story is set in medieval Germany. Yeah, but medieval Germany is before we have a concept of Europe, if, if I have to dig in. Okay. Challenge. Okay. <laughs> Let's see if he's carrying a knife. What, Hansel? Hansel, is it Hansel? Are you serious? I'll tell you what, he does sometimes have a broom. I don't think you're knocking a cucumber up with a broom. Shall we have a look? Yeah. <clears throat> nah. Right, this is a big moment. Slice. <laughs> <laughs> So, what so? I think I'm a the question I'm... to you is will you walk? <laughs> you were really drunk at the time. Sloshed. 
Rat ass. And just the one pant. Now I'm against 6.7% McLash. Yeah, but I've only had two pants. You've had more, you've had more pants than me. Dulum, dulum, dulum. Am I getting a, am I um, opening a glass of wine? Yeah. No, you're opening a bottle of wine and you're pouring a glass. <laughs> how long does wine, um, how long does wine, um, how long does wine, um, wine, oh. I mean, at this rate, quite a long time, I think. How long does wine... Um, um, it's, it's not about what it tastes like, anyway. It makes you feel really relaxed. Makes you feel lovely. <laughs> yeah. Cheers to that. Yeah. Cheers. Hi. Up your bum. I'm feeling tough tonight. We're going to be tough on people. I'm not going to let anyone off the hook. Let's be bolder, yeah. Oh, Horn, what have you done? I've invited the fun. Darth Vader. Ah. No more people wearing black. You've got 90 seconds to find a photo of this goon wearing all... All black. There's going to be City. all black. Sooty. I'm interested in Sooty. Sooty wearing all black is interesting. <laughs> I mean, it's not unlikely, is it? Oh, Sooty puppet with wand? Horn, tell me something else to type in. Sooty black clothes? Yeah, just type Sooty and sweet. How do you feel about your uh, searching there? <laughs> I mean, he was a magician. Surely he wore a black shirt. Hulk Hogan. Let's see if that guy ever boxed in black. Well, that's nowhere near all in black, is it? That's all in black. It's clearly not all in black. He's got white on him. Now then. <laughs> I'm definitely not walking for that, unless you can see his shoes. Horn is going nowhere. Whoa. I'm pretty happy, pretty happy with that. It's 90 seconds to find it. What do you think he's got in his shoes? Well, to be fair, I walked on Sarah Cox in all white, but we didn't see whether his shoes were white as far as No, I was amazed you walked on that. Well, if you're not walking, then that's insane. I am 100% not walking. Oh, Mark, what colour is his belt buckle? I, it's silver, maybe. Oh! Challenge. Fictional. Hulk Hogan is a persona, it says, but I don't know what you... Yeah, he's not fictional. <laughs> you want to walk it? I think it's the worst one that someone's not walked for. Also, you've shown me somebody with a black and white t-shirt and a black and silver belt. And you've shown me someone with a persona. Uh, Kathy Burke. Challenge. On black? Yeah. <laughs> well, you can't see all her clothes. I'm certainly not walking after what we've seen. Wait, 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 wait. Who, who's, who's, whose person is this? Mine. All right, I have to walk. Because if you're not walking, key's out. Oh, because of challenges? Yeah. Because you can't have Key lose on that. Well, I, I think I should walk if anything. It's, it's my person. No. This I love. Well, I think Key might win by, by default then. Are you both walking? Well, I'll I, walk if he's walking. But I think I'm out because I've well, challenged... Well, if that's what? the case, I'm also falling my sword, so Watto wins. I've, I'm not out. I've, I've, I've lost both my challenges, but I haven't used three. I, I, I'm walking on Mike Dean. What a game. Did I, ru did I ruin the game? I think I was aggrieved by Sooty because every example of him wearing clothes, he's wearing all black. All you've got to do is Google Sooty. Thing all that one. comes up is stuff like that. Is that <laughs> I mean, all he wears, Sooty, is black. He's a god. You've got to walk. You've got to walk in that situation. Oh, I think you've always got to walk. <laughs> this is, yeah, listen, it's difficult because Holland obviously famously didn't walk last week. That's why I bought a black shirt today. <laughs> I don't go off often out uh, first. I really enjoy the sort of downtime uh, aspect of it. It's lovely. It's disappointing. It is disappointing, but then you think, well, I'm just going to sort of watch the game now, I suppose. Yeah. I hated losing! <laughs> Rube Goldberg. No more people with a metal in their name. I don't really see gold as a metal. No, <laughs> but you don't see birds as animals. So I'm going for Florence Nightingale. Well, uh, I'm going to challenge... I think Florence Nightingale contains a metal tin. <laughs> Bloody hell. You know what? That is one of the great challenges of our ages. It's a brilliant challenge. That as well as anyone sees it. It's a good innings. Brilliant play, Horn. Let's shake hands. Horn is the champion of set three, but we were a five-set game here. And it's 2-1 to 
nil as we speak. <laughs>